everyone knows celebrities and everyone would recognize them in public if they saw them. Or would they? I took pictures of myself next to landmarks around Dublin and I'm going to be sneakily hiding celebrities into these pictures to see if anyone will notice. So this is the first picture we're going to be using. It's me at the entrance of Crow Park. And who else better to be at Crow Park than Danny DeVito? Danny DeVito in public. This one's good. That could actually, yeah, that could work. That could work. That could work. Okay, we're going to use this one. That looks good. That looks very good. Okay. Um, how the fuck do I do? I literally don't know anything about Photoshop. Oh God. Okay. Going to do that. And can I make, how do I make him smaller? Put him in the background there. He's still looking a bit big. If I have him like walking out the entrance, he'd be like, okay, no, he's still a bit big. He is a very small man. I need to keep that in mind. That doesn't look that bad. I mean, like, it probably is a bit recognizable. Is there something I can, like, can I add, like, a shadow to him to make him blend in more? Blur tool, maybe? Okay, that's a bit better. Okay, maybe that's a small bit too blurred, okay. You know what? We're just gonna leave it at that. Danny DeVito exiting Crow Park. Something I never thought I'd say in my life. Okay, next up we have me at the spire looking somehow even more awkward than the last picture. I don't know how that's possible. And since the spire is very high, it's like a skyscraper almost. We're gonna put Spider-Man somewhere in this picture. Yes, I'm putting Spider-Man into my picture. Ah, yeah, ah, okay. I can't really look up Spider-Man in public because it's a fictional character, but we'll give it a go. Oh wait, actually, if I look up Tom Holland behind the scenes, Spider-Man, here we go. You know what, this gun could work. That could that could work very well. If I could like have him clinging on to the side of the spire, that could work, that could really work, okay. Okay, there's a bit of editing that's gonna have to happen here. Look at me go. Increase the hardness. Oh, put down the size. Graphic designer in the making. Oh, there's also a fella just staring at his ass. Staring at the spider, yeah, holy shit, Tom Holland. Sorry, sorry, sorry. No more pervs allowed. Is this perfect? No, uh, but I am proud of the job I'm doing. I am very proud. Let me get rid of this little green hue around his edges. Or else it will be blatantly obvious that it's a Photoshop. That's good. That is, that is ready to go. That, well, not the picture, but like ready to be put into place. Where are we putting this fucker? Do we like put him on a lamppost behind or something? That is actually fucking brilliant. Holy shit, I'm actually good at this. Wait, if I put him smaller and then put him like further up. Look at that for a Photoshop, holy shit. Spider-Man is now in Dublin and climbing the spire. Okay, so this is the next picture we're gonna use. It's me outside the GPO, somehow not looking awkward in this picture. And who else is gonna be outside the GPO? Taylor Swift. Taylor Swift in Public. People are gonna think I'm like making a hit list for celebrities with the search history, honestly. How about this one? That one seems good, very casual. We'll try this one, we'll try this one. Make her a bit smaller, remove background. Perfect! A perfect Photoshop. Here we go, we gotta make her like the same size as the people in the background. Put her like maybe there? Is that good? Or no, wait, I'll put her here. I'll put her here and make it a small bit more obvious. That is so fucking obvious, oh my God. Okay, where's the blur tool? Give me the blur tool. Oh, this one is so obvious. Oh, this one is so obvious. Oh God. Oh, this is horrific. This is horrific. This is horrific. Oh my God. It's so bad. Fuck it, we're going with it. Taylor Swift at the GPO. Again, a sentence I'd never thought I'd say in my life. Next up, we have Mia Temple Bar. I'll be honest, I actually don't really know what to do with this one. Like who can I put in the background of this? Oh, 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 got an idea. I'm gonna have a celebrity Okay, just peering out the window. I'm gonna try my best to have a celebrity just peering out that little like top window there. Who could I do? Who could I do? You know what? We're gonna have Kevin Hart. Kevin Hart's gonna be peering out that window or somewhere in the picture. If I'm gonna have him in the window, I need to have him like facing forward towards the camera. Oh, that's actually a good picture. That's a good picture. What if I just do that at the corner of the bar? Forget the window thing, we're doing this instead. And remove background. That came out well, enough. Let me just fix it up. Just make that very even the whole way along. Shit, I've just chopped off Kevin Hart's leg. And then if I put him here, and then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna chop him in half. I'm gonna brutally murder Kevin Hart. Amazing grace. Oh. That actually looks really good. That's actually a really good one. Holy shit, I'm, I'm proud of myself again. I'm proud of myself. There we go, Kevin Hart at Temple Bar. <laughs> Oh, 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 oh,
Okay, next up we have me at Trinity College. I don't know why, but I'm just pointing at an old lady for some reason. Obviously Trinity College is a very posh and like fancy place. And because of that, I feel like I have to include someone that's very like posh and fancy themselves. So I think for this one, we're going to include two people. We're going to first put Benedict Cumberbatch in, and then I'm also going to include Max Vosch. Does this man ever not look posh? Jesus, fucking paparazzi. Okay, here we go. We're going to make him way smaller. Oh, he's so bright. Oh, why is he so bright? Oh, Jesus Christ. Look at him compared to the rest of the picture. How is he that bright? Okay, we're going to have to make him tiny so he's not recognizable at all. I have him like walking there. Next up, Max Fosh. Maybe if I took this one and then somehow found a natural way for his legs to not be in it. Remove background. Perfect. What if I like hit him behind these two people here? I feel like I'm making this very hard, but the whole point is for him not to be seen. I feel like if anyone's gonna see one so far, it will be this picture. <laughs> Next up, we have me outside a shop called Davy, because, you know, David, whatever. So I thought because the shop is called Davy, we should have another David in the picture. So that's why I thought we should put David Beckham in the background falling off the building. Yes, I'm petty because he's one ahead of me on famous birthdays. I'm coming for you, David Beckham. I'm coming for you. If I look up David Beckham diving, then surely something like him falling would come up. Oh, well, it's just pictures of him diving in the sea. Shit. Um, diving on pitch. Why is there literally no- Did this man never dive in his career? What the fuck? What about David Beckham fouled? What about that? Could I do that one? If I had him like that, and then just blatantly, obviously, just falling off the side of the building. There we go. Have him like up there. But I move back around. Okay, so the other fella's in it, but we could easily just get rid of him. This could be a good one. Yeah, that could work. That'll work. That'll work. Okay, that's a bit obvious. We'll make him a small bit smaller and maybe like heading down more. There we go. Give him a little bit of a blur. There we go. David Beckham falling off the side of the building. The last one, me walking down Grafton Street. I mean, the guy behind me is already the star of the show. Look at him smile. But I feel like this little area in between us could be perfect to hide a celebrity into. I feel like for the last one, I have to make it quite obvious for it to be like fair for people finding stuff. So that is why I'm just gonna be planting the rock into it. That's the picture. That's what you'd never see a man in Dublin ever wear. Oh my God, this is gonna be so obvious. I'm obviously not gonna leave him there. We, we need to move him. There we go. That is the worst one yet. That is so bad. If nobody sees that, all my followers must be completely blind. I'm now gonna post all these pictures onto my Snapchat story to see if anyone will notice. See you guys tomorrow. I'm still so awkward making this man, Jesus Christ. It's the next day. It's time to check if anyone noticed the celebrities. So we have come with me to different landmarks around Dublin. So we got Crow Park with Danny DeVito, The Spire. Don't know why I'm in the middle of the road. Very valid caption. Why the fuck was I in the middle of the road? GPO, Temple Bar, home of the most overpriced drinks in Dublin. Trinity College, home of the posh twats. Me outside somewhere called Davy. thought it would be funny. And finally, Grafton Street. Lad with the headphones is loving life. Like I'm literally pointing out the background. If someone doesn't see that, I don't know if anyone will see anything. All of these stories have no comments whatsoever, which is actually very surprising. But we do have three blue chats, which is worrying. One of them is for my followers. So we'll have a look. We'll have a look. No! Fuck! Oh, we got busted. We got busted. Ah, shit. What's The Rock doing in your photos and Kevin Hart? Fuck's sake. I mean, to be fair, they only saw two of them. You saw nothing. Only one person out of 85,000 followers saw that I'd photoshopped celebrities into the background of my pictures. I call that a win. I call that a win. And they only saw two out of like seven. I take that as a win. I'm done. That's a win for me. Goodbye, everyone. <laughs>